Ubuntu 25.04 Blocky Puffin will be supported until 9 months. <laughs> Comes with all three things, such as HDR, turbo buffering, and well being. As long as you're on Wayland and have a TV hookup of running on your device that you're using, you can see HDR where you just turn it on in the display settings. Well, well being. It comes with screen time and you can also enable grayscale if it, if it expires, how long it's going to take. Ubuntu 25.04 includes LibreOffice version 25.2 and this could be more efficient enough when you're looking at the dark theme. If you look at the background when you're just drawing something or writing something or whatever, if you're in the dark theme, it turns gray. If you're in the light theme, it turns white. Pretty handy. Let me know in the comments below on your thoughts about it. Finally, ever since Ubuntu 25.04 with Linux Kernel 6.14, and that version of Linux Kernel includes, most importantly, anti-sync. However, it does make the games run a lot better. Unfortunately, not always that relevant. And if we look at Unreal Tournament 2004, well, due to made with Unreal Engine 2, well, I don't hate the version of Unreal Engine, but if you're looking at the Direct 3D mode, when you're just running it on Proton, you can see the game's performance may still run a little bit jittery. Problem. There's number one. And here's number two. Yes, the more it keeps jittering, the more chance that the game will crash. It's possible. Be careful.
Well, for those of you guys who are wondering if the Warrior Startup sound is there, the answer is yes. However, it is disabled by default. If you want to turn it on, all you can do is click to enable. Well, that's about it in this video. If you enjoy it, please smack a like button and subscribe to see more of my videos on time.